Hello everyone out there, welcome once more to another very exciting edition and today we will be talking about how to get a medical job in Japan. It's very important when you come to this country as a medical doctor and you hold your license and you're confused and you might not be very good at the Japanese language, you don't have to worry, your English, it's okay and you can get around and you can do very very well. So if you want to know more about how to get a medical job in Japan, please stay tuned. Japan is a very amazing country and it's wealthy, it's rich, the medical field is very very amazing. If you are an IMG and you are in this country and you really think that you need a license and you want to work as a medical doctor, then you have to go through the licensing process as I said in the other video which you can check out the link um, um, somewhere around here. But if you want to go into the medical industry, there are many opportunities, there's many options and I'm going to share with you some of the links um, that you could apply for a medical job or a medical career um, to support either with clinical trials, to be in the medical industry, to either um, work um, as one of the managers in a medical sales company, in a medical device company. The list is illimited. You could work as a researcher in laboratory. You could work in a pharmaceutical company. Um, you could work with um, a company that produces specialized, um, um, let's say, softwares for medical purposes. You can work in um, producing um, paramedical devices and equipment. There's just illimited opportunities for you to join the medical industry in Japan. And um, this is the right way. I'm going to show you how you can apply for um, jobs using um, sites like Gaijin, um, Dai Jobs, and applying to random CROs online is also very important. Or biotech companies is very important. You can join um, very huge companies such as Takeda. You can join huge um, contract research organizations such as Paracel uh, and many others. So if you really want to know that, please watch the video right up to the end. I'm just gonna go ahead to show you um, how you can get this dye jobs um, in Japan. There's many opportunities. So uh, let me start here. So you can come to this website called Gaijin Jobs, and you can literally be able to get jobs. All right. Um, this is a very important site where you can actually apply for several jobs um, depending on the kind of job that you want to apply for so um, we're looking at medical jobs so you will look for here and you're looking for medical jobs so you will try to look for where there's medical jobs here this is um, hospital and restaurants so the scientific medical and health jobs here and once you do that, um, I'm not sure if there is anything available at the moment. I'm going to take um, all regions and then I'm going to try to search. Oh, at the moment, there is no job match that's matching my um, medical field that I'm looking for a job. But let's say I'm looking for sales, then uh, all locations, I could literally see um, open opportunities that you, know, um, you can apply for. Um, and usually there are some medical jobs, but this um, guiding but is not a very um, Good site for medical jobs to be more precise But here you can get other jobs and you can see who is actually offering the job So you can click on it and then you will get the job description here and the ID and where and When it was posted and when you're supposed to apply and the salary and what they require as well. They'll give you the job description and then you can be able to tweak your CV with respect to, to this. So for you to be able to apply generally, um, you can visit your website here or generally they can show you on how to apply. You can apply for positions that they have here. But generally you will need to sign in, you know, log into your account and then input your password. Like I do have here my email and password and then you log in and then um, if you don't have an account you need to create one so you will need to register um, for a brand new account um, right here another most important site is um, this one here is called die jobs so you can just um, push and research and you get um, die jobs and um, die job 
is one of the very famous ones in Japan where you can actually get a job. So it's this one right here, Die Jobs. And then you click on it and it's gonna take you right to the page where you can actually apply for it, depending again on the field. So the job categories are usually listed right here. Um, as you can see here, um, you're a medical doctor, you might want to work in the pharmaceutical, food, fabric, and, and uh, medical industry. So you click on it and then you can see all the available positions. Um, as you can see right here, uh, you can click on any one that you think best suits you. There is this one, rare disease engineer. Uh, they're recruiting and there's also this one that's a chief researcher position that is open in Kyoto um, there, there are many positions that are usually open there is this one is global supplier of PCR products uh, yeah and they require someone who has a subsidiary in Japan so there, there is usually many um, opportunities as research development and market lead there is this one that's urgently looking for a clinical research associate um, you know many medical doctors will actually fit with this and this is a, this is a paycheck that they are proposing um, up to about a hundred thousand dollars per year um, yeah you can apply for it um, sometimes this requirement to be native Japanese is not really really super important so usually don't let that fool you just apply for the job try to have some minimal level of um, Japanese once you have that um, I think that can be okay for you. For there, there are also some job opportunities that do not really need you to be able to speak Japanese. For instance, this one, and this one is at Michael Page International, and this one um, you could apply with respect to where you are located. It is still right up to a hundred thousand um, dollars per year in Japanese. You don't need nothing. So this one is for you to work in a um, development of cancer drugs. Um, so you can view the full listing just by pushing on it and then um, you can be able to uh, read all the necessary information of the job description here um, and, and you must have a PhD so always make sure you have this um, language skills are um, not required so it's not obligatory that you are able to speak Japanese as you can see here um, but you need a PhD. So even an MD can also apply. If you're an MD and you have a research uh, background with a, with a master's, then you can be able to do this. So um, I'm speaking from experience. And so you can be able to apply even though they say PhD is required. So an, an MD even with a research master's can be able to carry out this kind of jobs. And there is, you know, just lots more other jobs that you can apply for and just check what suits you very well make sure you take time again this is robert walters this is right to eighty thousand us dollars and um and they use english so they need some kind of product manager and you can view the full requirements here so sometimes they'll just need a master degree as qualification and then some years of experience so everything really varies and depends so you want to check this out and then you can apply for and it, it's very very easy this will be about the salary you need to show that you can be able to speak English so this will be a very good position for foreigners and it's quite easy you just push here and then you apply you know you might you might need to create an account with um, you know die job before and then you can be able to apply or you can directly sign up using your Gmail or Facebook or LinkedIn depending on whatever you prefer but it, it is very very possible so it, it is something to take into account and um, you can do that and so there is not only die job there are many uh, websites also I think also here right at um, Indeed you can be able to get a job let's say um, let's say right here at indeed you can be able to get an opportunity so this one is say you're looking for something around um tokyo or greater tokyo which is tokyo world 23 you can just you know you can search jobs around there you see so you got all of this you can you can become um a, a clinical research associate there and this will be your monthly salary about 270 
um, yeah so this is this can be small but it depends on if you are um, really in you know in a need for something or not so this will be the job description as well but there is many more there's plenty that you can be able to apply for and you get um, lots of um, offers so this these are just some like clinical development monitor you can work in Tokyo and then you can get the salary so what you need to do is um, just push on it see over here get the job description get the specific needs that they want right you know and then you know you should be able to read write and communicate in English so this is very important position so they want people who can actually speak in English so it is very good and your salary is about 70 to 10 million yen so um, plus bonuses and you know you have paid holidays as well so um, there is several and lots of opportunities that you can you can do um, I might know a few people who can also like directly um, shadow you and give you um, LORs LORs are letters of recommendation um, if you need those and you're a medical doctor and you're in Japan just you know send comments in the description and then we can help each other and support each other so that there's a lot of opportunities um, for you to work um, in alternative part ways in Japan and not just working as a clinician but there are also ways that you can work and um, most people who graduate from um, programs that are sponsored by JICA International Corporation Agency um, especially through scholarships like this one is offered specifically for um, people who come from Africa and um, they can be able to apply for it um, have this scholarship go through it and then later on you know have a business relationship with um, Japanese companies there are others of the Asian Development Bank as well that do sponsor some scholarship and then there is uh, um, other um, scholarships that also sponsor people from the rest of the world there is the overall mixed scholarship which is um, quite important and useful so generally that is it you can apply for jobs in Japan even if you're not um, practicing or you're not licensed but everything is possible just if you know where to get the information so I advise you to start by checking out guiding pod is important you can also have other jobs which are a little bit similar um, jobs in the educational field for instance um, in, uh, on guiding pot and then if you don't want that you could work in other areas and then you can move to die jobs which is also very important and you can also move to indie these are all um, platforms and i can um, recommend you to some contract research organizations and some research institutes where you can be able to um, get a job so yeah thank you very much and if you have any questions or comment please type them in the description box below all right that was about it thank you so much for watching if you like this video and you want to know more and you're looking for a medical job in japan please um type down your comment i will try as much as possible to help you if i have direct linking um i will try to link you or hook you up with um hiring um managers in companies that i know of and that i have a network in if you need my help please let me know in the description box and i will try as much as possible as i can help you um until then please watch the other videos and scholarships and um medical programs in japan and until then thank you and bye, -bye.